Today on the show, it's Quick Question, the show where I answer your questions quickly. And today's question is, what exactly is Gwenpool's origin? So Gwenpool is exactly what you think, but not at the same time. She is Gwen Stacy meets Deadpool, but not because her name isn't Gwen Stacy, it's Gwen Paul, spelled P-O-O-L-E. So if you think about it, she's Gwen Stacy, but in the not really kind of way. Gwen Paul first appeared on the variant cover of Deadpool's Secret War, and then she had a backup in Howard the Duck, and then she had a holiday special. And so far, there's honestly not that much to talk about outside of her origin, so that's just what we're going to focus on today. It is worth mentioning that at one point, she is attacking Howard the Duck, and she mentions how, in her universe, everyone that's in the Marvel Universe is just a comic character. So apparently her story first started when she went into Big Ronnie's Battle of Spandex and she sort of said to Ronnie, you know what, everyone in this world is an extra unless they wear a mask and a cape, so I don't want to be an extra, can you help me out? She has to fill out a form and write her powers and what's very, very interesting is that she writes down experience surviving interdimensional travel, knows all the secret identities and pluck. With those first two and her seeing everyone as a comic character, it would imply that she is from our universe or sort of like a Marvel equivalent of our universe. Ronnie makes Gwen's costume and sees that Gwen has pink hair and tells Gwen that she is going to wear pink because you will be star. Also, she decides that Gwen isn't going to have pants, just big boots. And that's how she became Gwenpool. And like I said, there's not really much else to talk about outside of this, which is kind of a shame, but also kind of exciting because it means her future is totally open. My only complaint is that at the moment, she does seem to be following the Harley Quinn format quite a bit. And as much as I enjoy the Harley Quinn format, I've already got Harley Quinn coming out from DC. I don't need a second one. I don't even want a second one. So I don't know. For me, it just makes me feel a bit uncomfortable. Like give this character her own identity and let her do her own thing. Let her pave her own way. But like I said, it is early days. So I guess they could just be using Harley Quinn as a template and letting her pave her own way from that. It's super Okay guys, that is it for today. So what do you think of Gwenpool? Please let me in the comments down below. And also don't forget to thumbs up and subscribe if you want to see more history videos. And also don't forget to like me on Facebook, follow me on Twitter to support the show by checking my Patreon if you want to see bigger and better and more history videos. And also don't forget to subscribe to my vlogging channel if you'd like to start your day with me every single day. My name is Faust, this has been Exploring Comics and it is super effective.